Hi, we're at college again. Hi, I'm back. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, okay. this one's back. Okay. She's gonna read. I'm gonna eat soup. <laughs> Today I have something special <laughs> planned, he says in a delighted voice. He lights up a cigar, takes a puff and blows the smoke into our faces. Cause that's not extremely rude. <laughs> we're doing a TV special. I could have guessed. We haven't done one in a while. Normally he tells us ahead of time so we can review the questions and create appropriate responses. If it doesn't just go, just, if it doesn't go right. Right, okay. Fratelio, freaking Romano, and I will have been in some big, big, big trouble. I mean, he might even blow more smoke on our face. We don't know. <laughs> Blowing smoke in one's face is the worst punishment. The worst. <clears throat> I mean, starvation, murder doesn't even doesn't even come close to the puffing of the smoke in the face. Okay, I'm putting on my glasses. Okay. No glasses. All right. Like I'll just cut. The <laughs> I'll just. Cut. I don't know what just happened. I had a hiccup, but I breathed at the same <laughs> time. It's better than sneeze farting. Uh, <laughs> it's like you're gonna. Do you can to explain, Rachel? <laughs> Okay, so I was watching this TV show. <laughs> sure. This girl was like in yoga at one time. I sneezed farted, so I sneezed, and then I also farted. <laughs> I was raised by my dad and my mom, but my dad had a huge influence on my humor, so I find it hilarious. I really do. Okay, back to the story. Okay, it's only a half an hour till we reach our destination. The moment we exit the limo, screams surround us from teenage girls like it's just a beaver <sighs> but then it's like not because it's like it's <laughs> like the guy's name i can't pronounce <laughs> Please. and and then there's you know hey fratilio oh we love you fratilio <laughs> fratilio italian name you know um fratilio and i plaster smiles on her face hey my just, chef Hi guys. This isn't annoying because it doesn't happen to us every other day of every waking moment. You need to leave. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and wave as we pass by screaming fans. This could be pretty entertaining though, watching the girls react to us. One time, I blew a kiss into the crowd and a girl fainted. <laughs> could you just imagine the after effect that like the mother's like, Oh my god, Susie! <laughs> Just like Susan, wake up, like just like you just think, like, and she faints, and they're just like, oh my god, my daughter, oh, yeah, and the guy's like, bye, and then just like someone called nine one one, and then everyone's like, Feliciano, and then Romano's like, yeah, it happens every day. <laughs> she screamed like I'm a so piglet. Piglet scream. What? What do you want from me? I just imagine her with like a pig face, like <laughs> just <a> pig face. <laughs> so perfect. Yeah. And was out cold. And then they called the ambulance and they found out she died of a fan attack. It's okay, guys. Fangirling, you know, it's a dangerous... It is. Dangerous job. I love Brandon so much that I choke on my own love for him. Yeah, I'm a little concerned, but not that much. <laughs> I'm just like, bring it, bring it. Okay. Um, we turn to our rooms where some ladies put makeup, makeup on us. And do our hair. I wish I had someone that did that for me. I'd be like, you're amazing. <laughs> After that, we are shoved into the stage. They're like, get on the stage. Mm -hmm. Go. Go. I chose you. <sighs> yeah, I choose you, Italy. Feliciana Brothers. Italy Marcus uses Brothers. surrender. It's highly effective. <laughs> the Germans are retreating. Okay, no, I'm just kidding. Germany caught it, Italy. Germany caught it, Italy. He does not want it. He tries to release Italy, jumps back into the Pokeball. <laughs> <laughs> That's basically what happened. Pretty much. Um, we make our way on to our <laughs> seats, smiling, waving as we walk. Our host, whom we have no idea who it is, silence the crowd. Hello, Vargas Brothers. I'm so glad you two were able to make it tonight. Like us, he seems to be genuine, but upon closer inspection, you can tell that he's playing it up for the audience. For Tilio, being the bad boy type, smirking and acting standoffish. I just, don't talk to me. I just, no, no, okay. Oh, hi. <laughs> Did you not know I was getting closer no, to I you? No, I didn't, I was reading the story, girl. <laughs> I was just like inching closer to you, like, what do you think she'll notice, guys? What do you think she'll notice? Just I won't face. I won't, I won't notice. <laughs> like, you should literally have to bash your head to mine and be like, whoa, whoa, bro, why? <laughs> and you'd be like, I was inching towards you. It wasn't like I was doing it purposely. And I would be like, Okay. All right. I'm I'm glad to be here. I'm glad to be here. Um, <laughs> you two are mirror twins, right? I'd be like, 
mirror twins. You mean we look the same? I'd be like, that's what you mean. Okay. Ah, uh, that's really cool. Those are very common. Stop. <laughs> I can't concentrate. <sighs> okay. What do you got? What do you guys think? He turns the crowd and everyone starts screaming again. And then they had to call the ambulance again because everyone fainted again. And it's just embarrassing after a while. <laughs> So you guys sing, dance, play instruments, paint, write, have your own clothing line, act, and cook. Is there anything you guys can't do? Fertilio puts on, turns on the charm, which isn't like him. Sadly, he said, oh, I should probably say, sadly, he said, <laughs> we can't visit all our fans and make their dreams come true. Are you raising your hand? Yes. <laughs> to what? intervene? Um... Why do you make it sound like he's gothic? Like, sadly, I'm just gonna go chat to myself, like, in my immortal. I'm just gonna go make it sound seducing, because he said we can't visit all our fans and make their dreams come true. But then I was like, <clears throat> I don't know. <laughs> I'm gonna fix this sentence, okay. Okay, sadly. Oh, where I lost. Okay, sadly, we can't visit all of our fans and make their dreams come true. Mm -mm. <laughs> Excuse me. Perfect. I drink soda, I burp. You know, you know the life. Um, he looks at the audience. I love you, Lovino. A male audience member. That's the first guy who's openly coming out and being like, love my body. Mm -hmm. Love me. <laughs> love me. I don't know what you're thinking, man. His shirt obviously says body on it on it. So, you know, I think I should repeat it myself. Hi. Um, <laughs> I could be heard screaming from the mass of people. I look over at Lob, Lob, whatever his name is, and ah. I notice a small eye twitch. Oh, that's pretty sweet. Well, I have some viewer questions for you, too. So he's like, that's really nice. Okay, moving on. Well, yeah. He takes out a few cards. Okay, the first question is for Lavino. Is the bad boy act just an act? No, it's not. It's stuck. Okay, he came up a sigh. Well, I'm not a good boy. Oh my gosh. You did, you did that on purpose. You did that on purpose. Well, I'm not a good boy. I can hear the bell tower. That's why I looked up and was like, what? I give him a grin. The best thing about this is I can mess with him. I lean over and hug him. Come on, Romano. You can be nice sometimes. Like when I wake up from a nightmare and you let me get into bed with you so I can feel safe and fall back to sleep. She's doing this on purpose, I swear. It's a really fan fiction. Okay. The crowd awed and his turn his face turned as red as a tomato or as bright as a tomato. He pushes me off. Coincidentally, the next question was, Do you honestly love your brother? Well of course I do. He's my little brother. I grin. I love you too, Romano. Yeah, yeah. Shut up. Okay. Don't let anyone know that I actually like you, but you know. Cause I have a Spanish boyfriend. You know. No spoilers. Okay. No, it turns to me. All right, Feliciano, your turn. This has a few parts, actually. Part one, have you ever been in love? Part two, yes, are you still in love? If no, do you want to fall in love again? This took me by surprise. I was thinking back years ago. I did love a person. I forgot her name already. But I haven't seen that person in a while, so no. You could say I am no longer in love. And don't really plan on falling in love again. You wouldn't want to tell the fans that. You'd be like, oh, yeah, I'm totally open to relationships even if you're not because bad business because yeah. if you're like okay fine <laughs> but who knows maybe some nice g lady will take me by surprise that little slip up is going to cause me some trouble i can already tell after the interview we go back into the limo on our way a few girls run up to us and we give them an autograph um who's lobby is that it's italy I just, I don't know after a while because it's just like. <laughs> she just asked who Lovino is. I don't. <clears throat> and care just call him Lobby. So, Lobby. You know what? Just answer the question. <laughs> Lobby is Romano. Dang it, then this has been Italy the entire time. Yes! <gasps> Did you think it's. No, I didn't. I knew it was Italy. Okay, good. Because I was about to be like, we've been over this so many times. I know, guys. I just. I just don't know. Okay, Romano! Uh, there we go. A man screams as he runs towards me. Quickly, I turn to a girl and start signing an autograph. <laughs> Romano! He yells at me. <laughs> Suddenly he stands in front of me holding a picture and a pen. Romano! He yells in my face. My eye twitches. Can I please have your autograph? And possibly more. And a kiss. And a marriage. What? I know. What'd you say? <laughs> um, 
Will you leave me alone if I do? Because secretly I'm in love with you. Um, his head nods vigorously. I already love this guy because I think I know who this guy is, and he better be who I is. Who, who I? <laughs> I grammar well. He better be who I is. <laughs> um. Oh, I just forgot that's something that I put in here and I cannot wait till you get it. Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> I just had like a mini seizure. <laughs> um, can I please, uh, uh da, 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 um, I sigh, take the pen and paper start writing. What's your name? I ask him. His face brightens up. Oh, I thought he already knew him previously. From that's what I was getting from. My name is Antonio. Oh my god. And I am your biggest fan. I started a fan club and I'm the club person. I'm so glad you took my suggestion on this. Makes me so freaking happy. Okay. I've listened to everything you've recorded and I've seen all your artwork and read all your books. You've been cool in person ever and I'm so glad that I finally got to do you. Meet you. Meet you. Meet you. Well, that, that escalated quickly. <laughs> hey, Spain can't control his inner... What were you doing? I have broccoli in my teeth. Oh. What did you think I was doing? Okay, Antonio can't control Just the uh, ha 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 in my teeth. <laughs> what was it? That one guy from, uh, what's it? Uh, that one movie, um... Gal uh, Guardians of the Galaxy when he did like the little thing they did. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're talking I about Star Lord, aren't you? Uh, I am talking about Star Lord. That was so funny. Oh my god. Guardians of the Galaxy. Oh my god. <laughs> Chris? <clears throat> Sorry. You okay there? <laughs> no. Um Yeah, yeah, I hand the paper bag. It read Dear Tony, leave me leave me alone. <laughs> Love Lavina and Vargas. That's so mean. Dude, he's mean. I just, I would cry if someone did that to me. No, apparently you're not, you're not Spain. Spain, don't worry, he loves you in the end. Love, he repeats after reading the message. The limo lines up and I get completely. I look back in the window and see Tony, Tony standing there basically frozen on the paper. He's like, I have a chance. Yeah, because he's like, love, and he looks up at those puppy dog eyes and it was like sparkles everywhere. And he's like, love. And then he's like, he loves me, but clearly everyone knows that he didn't mean really like, I love you. Leave me alone, but I love you. Because I'm Spain, hard to get, you know? Spain is a, a wonderful type of person. Spain is amazing. Like, I'm going to be honest. I don't know how he put with Romano. I, I would be like, you are single-handedly the most brattiest person I've ever met in my entire existence. Well, it's because I can kind of... Romano doesn't mean everything that he says sort of like me. Like, I'll be with Brandon and we'll be watching Fairy Tale. And I'll be very upset because I just watched something sad with Grey. Mm -hmm. And I'll be like, I don't want to watch this anymore. And he's like, Are you? Do you really not want to? I'm like, No. And then he'll turn it off. I'm like, What are you doing? Play the next episode. And I'll get super angry. And I'm like, You should know when I'm not telling the truth. Yeah, but you're not rude to to bring, um your boyfriend all oh, the no. time though. Well, no. But that's like this. That's the parallel. I'm just saying. Romano doesn't mean anything that he says like whenever he's just like shut up Spain's just like I love you too because I know that you when you're like shut up That's just how you are, but I know it's you saying you love me And he's just like shut up. I don't know why but I kind of want Spain and America to get together Okay, I don't know. I don't know the Patriot freaking I kind of want America one. to show up at some point and just be like dude <laughs> To walk out just straight up dude I need to stop. I'm lecturing her on her fanfiction. I'm so sorry, friends. Okay. Mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. What? Want another one? No. I'm gonna stick with my awesome soup. Thank All you. Alright, Feliciano's point of view. One of the girls approaches me. Feliciano, do, I, do you think I could be the girl who melts your heart? I smile at her. Maybe? You seem like a nice girl. I think you're- Can you see what I'm doing in the background? No, I'm really <laughs> no. chick. I can't wait for you to watch this and be like, Dana, what are you doing? <sighs> she's, she's, she's doing something, isn't she, guys? I just- I just don't know. Um, maybe you seem like a nice girl. I think you're doing it now. I think you're doing it now. Okay, I get it now. I get it now. Okay. Um, she hugs me tightly. I hug her back and the happiness of the situation calms me down. You'll find someone. I think you'll find hair again. <laughs> she giggles and winks at me. I think that was me in this fan fiction. I think that was me, you guys, because she totally got it. My face burns in embarrassment. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay. I hope no one else knows that. The girls walk away smiling as we get into the limo. Falling in love again is not an option. Not in my world. 